In that moment, you are absolutely alone and you're alone with your own mortality. And that was the first time I really became aware that I could die from this. When I was 34 years old, I was diagnosed with blood clots in both lungs and a blood clot in my left leg. I was hospitalized for nine days. All I could think of was I've got a child to take care of and I've got a husband and I can't die. I first met my current doctor immediately after I was diagnosed with my blood clots 18 years ago. And then I got this letter. It was from my insurance company and it said that the medication I've been on for the last eight years, I'm not gonna be able to continue on it anymore and I'm gonna to have to switch to another brand of medication. And I was shocked. Non-medical switching is when patients like me are forced to switch medications for reasons that are not medical. It's dangerous, it, especially in a class of drugs like the blood thinner I take. It, it can actually be downright deadly. And this affects so many patients every year. We need to have decisions be between a patient and their doctor only. My insurance company does not know me. They do not know my medical history. My doctor knows me. My doctor knows my medical history. He has worked with me for 18 years. I trust him. If a patient is stable on their medication, no matter what that medication is, let them stay on it. It's about what's right and wrong.